I actually want to grow my beard a bit bigger now. Grow my hair long, but on a little bit more muscle. Just a little bit. So I've just been to see Aquaman. Permission to come aboard. It was absolutely awesome. Well, there were some bits in it were a little bit kind of like Doctor Who-y. It's coming to the surface. But forgetting that bit, it was pretty cool. I actually want to grow my beard a bit bigger now. Grow my hair long. But on a little bit more muscle. Just a little bit. Yes, I have a man crush on Aquaman. There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> the other day, I did that, and somebody left me a comment saying, I love your videos, Nick, but please don't slurp your tea. <laughs> It's a sound effect. It wasn't actually me. So this is kind of another one of those videos that I'm putting out there, hopefully over Christmas. Um, and I'm going to try and get up a few videos if I can, uh, just to sort of try and cram a bit in over Christmas. Because I've got a bit of time off. <laughs> and uh, it's quite nice. I've got about two weeks off of work, which is really good. Um, and work kind of consumes me quite a bit and I always try to get videos out within the work schedule as well So obviously I'm doing my work thing and then I come home um, And I sort of dabble in the workshop people and dabble in the workshop kind of in the evenings and at the weekends when I can um, But obviously having two weeks off, you know Hopefully we'll be able to have a bit more time in the shop for you guys and I'll be able to put out a few more projects I thought that might be quite cool if I can, that is. No promises. So if you're listening to this one, this will be one of those projects. But I was sat there and I was thinking, what do I... I'm really stuck for ideas for, for stuff for me mum. And I've got a few things, but I thought to myself, what can I give my mum? She's had a vase. She's had a bowl. She's had another vase. She's had a pot. And probably another vase. So what else can I give her? Not a vase. Or a bowl. Or a pot. But then I thought to myself, ah, I know what I can make. Something... Kind of along the lines that's quick and simple, but funk it up a little bit, as you do, and try to make some kind of a music box. I thought that would be quite cool. Now I bought myself a little music contraption, which I need to insert inside the box. But first of all, we do need to make the box. Now I've got some ideas to mix it up with some wood, and I'm not sure if I want to make it all entirely round. I want to kind of maybe cut a bit off here and cut a bit off there, just to make it weird looking. Well. Funky looking. <laughs> Just different, basically. So I hope you enjoy this one. It is going to be for Christmas, so it's going to be a Christmas present for me mum or mum. And uh, if you're watching, hope you like it, mum. So I hope you enjoy this one.
Oh yeah, check this out. Loving this red paduk or pink. Okay, so that's the inside of our box done. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna make the lid for this. And I found this to do the lid. It's called Cambalia. I think. Okay, first what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to make this fit the base.
Okay, so there's the bottom that we've managed to get on there, and that's quite cool. I kind of like that wood. I think it's zebra wood, that is, so that's quite nice. So that's fitted on the bottom, ready for my emblem. Um, so now what we're going to do is going to drill some holes in here to see if we can fit this little music box. Haven't finished with the lid yet, but as you can see, there's the top ring piece, and I've just made this on top because obviously we need to be able to hear the music playing so I'm going to get this fitted in here I don't know how to fit it in yet because at the moment it just slots in there which is quite nice but uh, what we're going to do is going to try and maybe make a ring or something try and fit in there and tighten that in maybe glue that in I don't know yet but uh, we'll work on that in just a second but first let's drill some holes This was actually a little bit more complex than I kind of originally planned. It was just a little bit fiddly, obviously this was a little bit fiddly to get that in there, I didn't know how to hold that in. In the end I kind of just pushed it in there and squeezed this down because I left a little bit proud uh, underneath and it just squashed itself kind of in there. So you won't really need to get back in there anyway, so that's just in there now fairly well, it's not going anywhere, the lid's pretty tight. That obviously also helped the lid as well because the lid was a little tiny tiny bit loose um, but now it's okay and I roughed it up a little bit because I kind of just didn't want it to be just round you know I kind of just wanted it to be a little bit different and so I just sort of chop it up a little bit halfway through chopping it up I was thinking oh my god what are you doing and I bet everyone else was thinking the same thing oh my god and then it just suddenly sort of started to become something different and I kind of like it really it does have a little bit of a crack in it, it was a little bit of a shame but 
Saying that, we're going for the kind of oldie little look anyway. I have sort of super glued it up, so it's okay, you can't really notice it. And because of all these little bits and pieces in there anyway that I've sort of chopped in there, it looks alright. Um, got the little, uh, oh, what's it called? Zebra wood on the bottom there, which looks quite sort of tasteful, I think. Um, and then obviously we've got this, uh, I can't remember what that was called now. Do you remember that, what that was called? Um, oh. I don't know, I'll have to look back at the video. Well, you could just skip to the video. Well, you probably know anyway. Um, and this is obviously Paduk. Uh, that's quite a nice wood as well. Works really well with those both of those woods there, I think. Um, yeah, just glued them on. So obviously, so you can get access to this and you can access the little turning uh, knob thing. So there it is. Happy Christmas, mum. No doubt she was already had this and this video will be going out after Christmas, I hope. Want to hear it again? It's a really nice tune. Um, it sounds a bit like the theme tune from Rocky, but I'm not entirely sure what tune it is actually. Um, I bought obviously, you know, the chime thing in uh on eBay, um, and I can't remember. I think it did say what it was, but I can't remember now what it was. If any of you know what that tune is, let me know in the comments. But I'm pretty sure it's the Rocky theme. You know, when they're kind of like walking along, arm in arm, you know, him in. Adrian, what you I'm pretty sure it sounds very similar to that type of tune. Anyway, I hope you like it. I hope it wasn't too long for you. It did actually take me a lot longer than I kind of anticipated, just because it was there were some fiddly parts in it. I made a few mistakes, um, but I managed to kind of get around them. But yeah, overall, I think it's all right. It's not going to be a bad Christmas present. So. Happy Christmas, Mum, and Happy Christmas to all of you as well. And I hope you enjoy watching me make this. Thanks for joining me on the channel today. I really do appreciate your support. Just recently, we hit over 300,000 subscribers, and I just cannot believe it. Just absolutely crazy. Thank you so much for all of you that have been with me. Been with me? Been with me? They <laughs> that have been with me from the beginning uh, and obviously thanks to all the new subscribers that have come over I really do hope that you stick around there's obviously lots of videos go and check them all out please have a little rummage through and uh, I know it takes ages to go through videos especially if you've just kind of joined the channel kind of last week or something and you logged on and wow there's like 200 videos there it's gonna take you some time to catch up but you need to watch them. Um, don't forget to select the bell uh, if you want to be notified of my videos when they pop up and it just sends you a little ping message on your screen or email or something like that, just basically saying, yeah, he's put a video up, you know, then you can just, then you just know, you know, then you can go and watch it. Or you can save it for later. Um, again, thanks very much for watching, guys. Hope you like it. I'll leave stills up at the end. Happy Christmas again. I think I've said that about 10 times already. But hey, it's Christmas time. You know, you gotta say this stuff. I'm off to bed now because it is pretty late again. I'm always seem to be in the shop gone past like midnight these days. I think at the moment it's um, about half 12, one o'clock in the morning and I'm still in the shop. So I've got to get to bed. Thanks guys, take care and I'll see you all soon.